Vice President Kamala Harris has voiced her deep concerns about the significance of the forthcoming presidential election, particularly in light of former President Donald Trump's potential re-election and his alleged plans to weaponize the Justice Department against political adversaries. This is probably the most significant election of our lifetime. You know, we have said it every four years, but this here one is it. We are looking at an election that will take place in 122 days. 122. Where on one side, you have the former president who is running to become president again, who has openly talked about his admiration of dictators and his intention to be a dictator on day one, who has openly talked about his intention to weaponize the Department of Justice against his political enemies. It's quite ironic that Harris points to Trump weaponizing the Justice Department, given her belief that the current administration has already done so. The recent investigations and prosecutions of Trump and his aides are often cited as politically motivated actions. While both sides agree on the election's importance, their reasons starkly differ. This presidential election is viewed as a pivotal moment to either restore traditional American values or to continue policies seen as progressive. Harris's insistence on the election's critical nature highlights the intertwined interests at play. Her claims about Trump's admiration for dictators are often dismissed by his supporters as exaggerated or baseless. They counter with his administration's foreign policy achievements and measures against authoritarian regimes. Many see Harris's remarks as fear-mongering tactics aimed at undermining Trump's credibility.